Halley's Comet 2019. What time will eat a querid meteor shower peak? Halley's Comet stands in for the Star of Bethlehem. Halley's Comet has been recorded as early as 467 BC by the Greeks. Halley's Comet will produce the stunning Eta Aquarid Meteor Shower this weekend. So what time will Eta Aquarid Shooting Stars peak? Halley's Comet will not return to Earth skies until the 2060s. But stargazers can this weekend catch a glimpse of Halley's Comet in the Eta Aquarid Meteor Shower. Our planet is currently passing through a patch of debris created in the wake of Halley's Comet. When this space debris impacts Earth's atmosphere, it incinerates and lights up the night sky in the form of streaks of meteors. The best time to view this shower of shooting stars is in the pre-dawn hours on Saturday and Sunday. In good news for stargazers, the new moon will just be a small silvery crescent, so its light won't wash out the view. And in addition, the Met Office has confirmed clear skies are forecast during the meteor shower's peak. These meteors earned their unusual moniker Eta Aquarid because they appear to arrive from the Aquarius constellation. Specifically, these shooting stars emanate from a star near the top of the Aquarius constellation. Stargazers actually get two shots at watching this patch of space debris each year. The shooting stars reappears again in October, when the skies light up with the Orionid meteor shower. The difference being that during October's meet shower, the shooting stars appear to emanate from Iran. U.S. Space Agency NASA notes the Eta Aquarids are particularly fast meteors, which can leave glowing trains, incandescent bits of debris in the wake of the meteor, which last for several seconds to minutes. NASA adds it will be easier to spot the meteor shower in the southern hemisphere because Aquarius is higher in the sky for that half of the globe. Meanwhile, Aquarius is closer to the horizon in the northern hemisphere. Those of us in the north can expect to see approximately 10 meteors an hour grazing the horizon in the hours before dawn, while those in the southern hemisphere can look forward to seeing as many as 40 meteors per hour. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.